Well, howdy campers. It's another gorgeous day here at Johnson RV here in Fife, Washington. We are the Northwest's largest premium pre-owned dealership. Our buyers actually look for our units around the country. They look for low miles and very gently used. Then it goes into a reconditioning process to bring them as close to new as physically possible. Behind me is a perfect example of that. And holy moly, this thing is a monster. We are looking at the 2011 Forest River Charleston. This is the 430 QS model, which means this is going to be a big 43 foot tag axle class A diesel pusher. Um, this is sitting on the Freightliner, uh, Freightliner chassis and it is being pushed with the Cummins 425 horsepower diesel engine. So let's check out a few of the features on this thing. First, you'll notice this gorgeous one piece windshield. That's going to be for all those uh, beautiful views you'll be experiencing while driving around the country. You'll notice that got this great inverted mirror there kind of uh, unique but you're going to be able to see everything uh, behind you on top of that this unit's going to come with a blind uh, blind spot side camera uh, once you hit the blinker your monitor is automatically going to switch over to where you're safely switching lanes to the left or the right hand side you'll also notice that this unit is full body paint absolutely gorgeous colors um, you do have an automatic uh, awning over your entryway here the step here is also powered so when you open or close the door that's going to come in and out you also notice that we've got a nice big power awning over the slide here and on the slide itself you'll notice that we do have slide toppers that's going to prevent moisture and debris from getting in there and ruining your slide mechanism follow me this way i'll show you some of these compartments all right so starting here you've got a tiny bit of storage and then if I could get these open, there we go. Double door, um, pass-through storage there with Joey tray. So that's gonna be able to slide left or right depending on which side you're trying to load from to just make it super easy. Very nice high quality doors here too. Super, super firm. Um, you've got another pass-through storage here. So definitely a ton of storage on these nice big tag axle units. Um, you'll notice back here we do have our rear bedroom slide. Um, I did mention this is a tag axle, so you do have the dual axles in the rear here. Moving on back here, you got your battery compartment. Now the bottom ones there are on a slide tray. Uh, very easy just to pull those out, um, have access to those. Um, and then you also have your chassis batteries as well, all located in one easy to reach location. And then last but not least on this side, um, you do have your converter, big old magnum, uh, or I'm sorry, inverter uh, for your unit. You do have two shutoff switches right there, which is gonna prevent you from killing those batteries when you're not using the unit. Swing on back here. We'll start top to bottom. First thing you'll notice, we do have an integrated backup camera here. Uh, we do have a full um, top to bottom access ladder to be able to access your roof uh, to do those you know, yearly checkups. Um, as I mentioned, nice big Cummins 425 engine, uh, basically going to set you up for all your towing needs. You're already hooked up, ready to rock and roll uh, with 7-pin as well. Another couple slides over here is what you'll notice first and foremost. But in here is where you're going to have a couple things. Number one, you've got your nice big 50-amp uh, shore power cord there on an actual spool. So that is an option for this thing. It is automatic, so you're not having to lug around that big heavy uh, cord when you get into your camp spot. Definitely an option worth worth uh, looking for. You do have these nice lights too uh, when you're when you're running down the road at night. This thing is all lit up like Christmas. Looks absolutely phenomenal. Into this next one, we do have our all-in-one. Um, this is absolutely awesome for when you're pulling into the campsite. You don't really have to open up very many compartments. It's just this one. You're going to be able to uh, hook up your black and gray tanks. They're all right there. Uh, you get your water going in there, either with the hose or with the fill. Um, you do have an outdoor shower out here. You do have water filtration system for the unit as well. So all right there, all super easy. They've thought of everything, haven't they? Oh. And... Just want to open up this side. I know we looked at it from that side, but if you notice there, we do have an in-house um, vacuum system. So that's a Dirt Devil brand, um, just to be able to keep the interior super clean. So just about does it for the outside. So join me on the inside. 
Good golly, Miss Molly, I am sitting in comfort. I'm in this flex steel chair in the captain's area of this gorgeous 2011 Forest River Charleston. This is a big, big diesel pusher, you guys. This is the 430 QS model, 43 foot tag axle. I'm sitting up here and I just want to point out a few things. Absolutely elegant features here. Everything is within fingers touch. Um, this steering wheel does come down. Um, it does this and it also telescopes in and out so really anybody could drive this thing. Um, I have everything that I need here uh, starting with on the left I do have my auto leveling system touch of a button it's gonna just uh, go down you do have your gears here parking brake your mirror um, your heated mirror systems here to, uh, to be able to adjust them as well. Um, on, well you have your instrument cluster obviously on my right side here starting from the top we do have our Jensen CD player this is also your monitor for your backup camera as well as your side view cameras. So when you're changing lanes, you're looking here and at your mirrors. Um, and when you're backing up, you're, you're just looking right here. Uh, tons of different buttons that do different things. Uh, you got your air horn, you got your fans, you got your engine brakes, uh, gen, gen start there, as well as just your basic air conditioner and heater. As I mentioned, I'm sitting in a very, very comfortable flex steel chair. This is ultra leather too. Um, these do spin all the way around, forward, backward, up, down, um, basically everything you need to do. So that being said, again, I'll point out the one piece um, windshield here, obviously just gorgeous views, but follow me back here. I'll show you the rest of this thing. First off, you'll notice the floors. These are tile floors here. Um, they are real and um, absolutely added element of elegance to this unit. You'll notice all up above you have plenty of storage space here. Right here we do have a um, an ultra leather couch. This does fold out into a sleeping area. Moving back here, we do have table and chairs here. Nice solid surface on top. There are two additional chairs too if you're uh, traveling with four people. Behind me, you'll notice that we do have a flat screen TV. A little bit of storage up above as well. And a nice little glass cabinet underneath as well for all those DVDs and whatnot. Uh, that you'll be taking with you. You also notice that there's a ton of space in here. That's because these two slides are opposing slides. Uh, just opens up the whole living area very nicely. On my right hand side we do have our solid surface countertops. Uh, two, um, two sink basins here with a stainless steel uh, gooseneck faucet. You've got tons of storage in here and these shelves are actually adjustable. Right here we have a nice big convection style microwave. This is an oversized convection. Be able to cook all your dinners there. Underneath there you've got your three burner stove top. That's gonna be, uh, uh, it's gonna use propane um, for cooking. And then you have an additional storage underneath. Nice big deep drawers. I mean these things are absolutely huge. Any pot pan, it's gonna fit just fine in there. On the other side of the living room, we do have an, an opposing couch, um, and this also folds out into a sleeping area. Again, nice wood, uh, cabinetry, tons and tons and tons of storage. Moving our way back this way, we do have our Dometic um, thermostat here. It's gonna be just like you have at home. Um, and then it looks like you've got your Fantastic fan, which is right here. You've got your controls for that. Also, for the kitchen area, you've got your nice four-door fridge and freezer combo. Nice big deep fridge and freezer here. You'll be able to take a ton of food with you um, on those longer camping trips. Here's what most people really like, especially with the longer trips, is you do have your stackable washer and dryer. Uh, be able to, you know, get all those kids' swim stuff uh, washed and dried and ready for the next location. Moving on back. This is one of my personal favorite parts. We are in the bathroom area. You notice we've got the his and her sinks. Super nice solid surface countertops there. Tons and tons of storage. Uh, you do have vanity lights throughout for either side. And then if you swing around here, you do have your commode there. Now this is real porcelain. I should uh, point out you do have your own fantastic fan inside there as well. Nice solid doors here as well. This is something that I always like to demo, especially with these nice big diesels, is I'm standing in the shower. I'm about six feet tall. Look at all the headroom I have above me. Nice elbow room, shoulder room. I'm not going to have a problem having a shower in here. We'll swing back into the bedroom. We have our nice pocket doors here for privacy. Um, those just open close like this. 
Um, swing around this way though. Solid surface counters, you got tons and tons of storage on either side of this flat screen TV. Nice big bedroom window here. Uh, be able to enjoy those views. Huge, deep, deep access. I mean, my arm's all the way in. Barely able to touch the back there. And then you do have your actual closet that closes like a regular closet. Uh, hang all your clothes and whatnot. Huge, big, king-size bed. This is what dreams are made of, folks. But uh, anyway, I'm sure you're going to have a ton more questions about this unit or others. Uh, make sure you call. Ask for me, Justin. Our number here is 888-833-9766. We'll see you soon.